What's, What's up, up West Creek? Creek? I'm Sean Hall. I'm Josiah Jones, and you tune in to Coyote Entertainment Television. The show all about the creek. Tune in each Friday for fun skits, segments, and important information that you may need to know. To kick us off with this week, we had our very own Coach King try a bunch of different Asian foods. What's going on, guys? Welcome to a new debuted episode of Coach King Eats. The idea of this is I've got my CET crew in here and they're giving, giving me some random food items that they think would either be funny or interesting for me to try and then um, see how I like it. I'm scared. God. I went to my local Asian market and okay. I found you some hot wasabi peanuts. Roasted hot peanuts. They actually look like peas. You see that? Oh, this is like an actual can. Yeah, you gotta open it up. Like, this isn't like a... Oh, no. You know, it's so good, you can keep it in. Oh, you have, you have to actually, like, crack the top. Oh, I'm so scared. It smells like peanuts. Okay. Yeah, it just smells like peanuts. That's a good start. <laughs> <laughs> okay. They don't... It, I mean... I don't even know how to describe how they look. They don't look appetizing at all. I don't, dude, I hate, I hate super spicy things. Why'd y'all do this? All right. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Golly. You know what? It's like, the very beginning is ridiculous. Like every bit of wasabi. That's not that bad. That's not that bad. But uh, I like peanuts. Um, I don't know. Six out of ten. I didn't mind it. <laughs> so you finished your first round, mm -hmm. and uh, I didn't think you were done with peanuts. So I got you. That's crazy. <laughs> some peanut butter balls. Oh, two dollars? It's a steal. It's a steal. 150 calories. Not bad. Now there's so much air in here. It's like a Lay's bag. Yeah. Boom. <laughs> Bro, what is that smell? It smells like peanuts. Why does it smell like that? What does it smell like? For the viewers. I can't, I don't want to say. <laughs> it smelled like, like, booty. It was bad. <laughs> it was bad. Bro, what was that? You smell it. Okay. All right. Um. <laughs> <laughs> what? Well, we can see the anatomy. It's a, uh, yep, that happened. All right, we're gonna go with this one. They're very fragile. They're very fragile. You kind of hear a little peanut on the inside or something. I like the wasabi peas better. <laughs> Ugh. <laughs> Ugh. No. Not even another bite? No. Somehow you like wasted two dollars. Like, <laughs> that's so bad. That's so bad. Uh-uh. No. Two out of ten. That's horrible. It's like the outside is like really thin and it disintegrates. Though. The inside doesn't even taste like a like a peanut. It's ugh. That sucked. That was horrible. Yeah. I think you close your eyes for this next one. Oh. <laughs> Bro, how many are there? There's one more. There's one more. 
Oh, show it to the camera. Here, bring it over here. Is it that bad? No, no, it's not bad. Devin, if it's these shrimp chips, are they are they open? No, no. So <laughs> you can open your eyes now. <laughs> okay, this is this is as bad as it gets. He had these, and I wanted to just like take them out of his hands and throw them away myself. You buy this, and you're like, hmm, this is good. Like you really say that. Really? Oh God! I don't want to, dude. Bro, <laughs> that smells so bad. It smells like I don't, <laughs> shrimp, right? Frog? No. It's just like it smells like rotten fish. This is inedible. I'm just gonna smell like this all day. What's the name of the show? Sticking Eats. We gotta eat it. Oh my god. Eat it, eat it, <laughs> eat it, eat it, yeah. He's gonna do it. Those don't look appetizing. Eat that. Chicken. No, nothing about this. Smell that. Peanut butter balls like are gonna be sparks. worse. Yeah. <laughs> it really wasn't that bad. No, you gotta do a whole chip. You gotta get it. The up. whole okay. thing? There's a trash can next to you. Dude, just eat it. There's a trash can. Get the... Ain't no way this is good. Eat it. Eat it. You're like a little kid playing Bro, with I don't want to. <laughs> I will say, it doesn't taste how it smells, but off of smell alone, it's made my stomach completely turn. How would you uh, rate that? Off taste or everything? Everything. Oh, like a one. Right. This is a one. Smell alone gets this like a negative. I mean, it smells exactly how you think it's gonna smell. There's no taste to it, right. but it tastes bad at the same time. Ugh. <laughs> oh my God, no, I'm done, I'm done. Do your three trials for this. Oh. Uh, you have anything to say to the viewers? I regret agreeing to this segment already. Give me those wasabi peas. Thank y'all for watching me get tortured for the last however many minutes this is. Hopefully it's short. Uh, see y'all next time. Hopefully not on Coach King Eats. This sucked. <laughs> <laughs> So now, you just want to give him like a, a goodbye, you know. This is the last time you'll see this. Moving to a more serious note. In regards to September being Suicide Prevention Month, we want to spread more awareness. Our team's put together a PSA about suicide awareness. Take it away, team. This month is Suicide Awareness Month. Here are some signs to watch out for. And ways to help if you or someone you know is suicidal or has suicidal thoughts. Some signs of suicide may include giving away personal items, taking extreme risk, eating or sleeping less, confide in someone you trust. You have more friends in this building than you may realize. Speak to one of our counselors. They're always here if you need someone to talk to. Talk to someone about your feelings. Don't bottle everything up. Or call the suicide hotline 988. Or text the crisis text line at 741741. Again, if you or anyone you know is suicidal, please text or call the hotline. 988. Remember, the world is better with you in it. Love each other. We're going to send it over to our reporter, Ryan Rolica, for your weekly scores, updates, school news, and weather reports. Take it away, Ryan. Hello, West Creek. This is Ryan Rolica with your local news reports, scores, and weather predictions. Last Friday, our Coyote football team came up to an unexpected loss against Rossview with 31-7. Our girls' soccer team played against Kenwood this past Tuesday and won 9-0. And our girls also re rescheduled the game against Clarksville High on October the 3rd. Now for the weather. Expecting the temperatures to increase as the day goes by. Expected temperatures should be in the 70s to the 80s and should be very rainy throughout the weekend and Monday. As for the other days, it should be very cloudy and we are expecting very little bit of humidity for the week. 
And as you all know, we have an upcoming football game against Kenwood tonight. Come on down to see our Coyotes in action. Be sure to wear black since today is Friday the 13th. That's all the news I got for you this week. Back to you, Josiah and Sean. And that's all the time we have here for the fourth episode of CET Coyote Entertainment Television. We hope you enjoy. And as always, we, we are, are West Creek. Creek.